I'm Lauren Plant, and we start this showdown with the Team Gymnastics State Finals from Plymouth. 13 schools competing. Forest Hills United, state runners up a year ago. Senior Christine Byam in the floor exercise. She ended the day with the top all around score in the state. FH United took sixth. 2006, the last time a Farmington United squad hoisted the top hardware. Some impressive wins this season included the Rockford Invitational, the Junior ISO Bills on the bars. Farmington finished fourth. Brighton looking to better a 2016 10th place finish. The senior Courtney Casper had the second best score on the unevens, helping Brighton to third, their best in a dozen years. The 2014 champs Canton definitely in it to win it. The junior Rachel Sosha on the beam. The Chiefs had the top score on the bars and had finished either first or second five of the last six years. 2017 runners up. Rockford came in the two-time defending title holders, but several D1 level girls graduated last summer. Rams reloaded with the momentum of the top regional score in the state and a pair of aces up their sleeve in Nicole and Carly Coughlin. Nicole finished third in the all-around and the Rams won the floor. The senior sister duo competed in all four disciplines and the Rams had the highest score on the vault too. Carly Coughlin, an all-around fifth place finish. Rockford becomes just the fourth team in 45 years to win at least three state titles in a row. Congratulations.